In this quick video I am going to show you how you can display categories on your posts. So in the previous video we displayed images and the video before that we displayed these titles right here and now we are going to display categories. So as you will see we will run into some kind of a same issue that we did with the images. Uh, because if you go to our REST API, we can see that categories have only IDs here. So we got for this post ID 6. And we don't want to make another request to the server to get just the name of the category. So to correct that problem, uh, we are going to manipulate our REST API a little bit, just like we did with images, to get the list of categories right here. So how would you get the list of categories in WordPress? Well, you have a handy uh, function for that and it's called get the category. So in our functions PHP file, we can just do something like gets, gets equals to get the category and we have to pass it an ID. So we already have access to post object. So just like we did with thumbnail ID, we can just do post ID. Okay. And now we have to define a field uh, in our API. So just like we did with thumbnails, we just do data and uh, we will call it also gets because we can call it categories since we already have a field called categories right here with the IDs of the categories. So we are just going to do gets equals to gets. And that should be it. Save this. Uh, we can confirm that it works by refreshing our API. And as you can see we now have field gets with the term IDs, the name, the slug and so on. So now we have access to that uh, category objects. Okay, so next thing we are going to be doing is we are going to display those categories on our page. Just remember that I already have all the CSS written for this theme, so I just have to add tags or classes to my elements to make it look kind of pretty. So the next thing we need to do, we need to display those categories below the titles right here. But to do that, uh, we need to actually make a v4 loop to go through all the categories. Because if we check out our API a little bit better, we can see that cats is actually an array with ha which has some objects in it. So for now, all the categories have only one object uh, because all the posts have only one categories. So if we go to this first post and do quick edit and add more categories to it, so let's say movies, cars and books and update it, you will see in our REST API that this is going to look a bit different now. So as you can see categories, the default categories have 3, 4, 2 and 6 and our cats now have an array with objects of term ID 3, 4 and so on. So we have to do a v4 to display those categories. And to do that we are just going to do small. So I'm going to add it to a small tag and then we have to do v4 equals to and then you do category. So this is what we are going to be calling our local variable in post.cats. So we are calling this array right here. And now we can just display the names of the categories. So we can do category.name. And that's it. Save it and let's just check out our page right now. And as you can see, this first post has a few categories, but the second posts have only one. And that's about it. So we display the categories on our page. 
okay so this is it for this video don't forget everything we did here will be available for you on github uh, the link will be in the description below uh, if you like this video please like it uh, if you like the channel please subscribe to the channel also follow me on twitter or on facebook if you want thank you guys for watching and i will see you in the next episode